Hello, freaks and geeks, and welcome to another NIS Race Weekend. And well, today we're doing Indi Indianapolis. Um, I wanted to actually do Pocono last week, but I honestly got the track a bit too late, and I wasn't able to get a race time or race session or race slot or whatever down. And yeah, kind of kind of sucks, but. Uh, needed to get Pocono anyways. Now, I'm gonna, you know, not actually qualify. Mainly because, well, for the number 23. So that means if we don't qualify, we're gonna be starting towards the back anyways. They're showing us the black flag. You didn't enter the pit safely. You have to drive through the pit without stopping. Oh wow, uh, is our... Did it save our brakes? Yeah, it did, okay. Green, green, green. Okay, here comes your first time lap. But yeah, we're just doing this to get ourselves warmed up. Broke way too early there. Honestly, Turn one on this track always kind of gets me because um, because of the brake markers are extremely hidden on the front stretch. That was a 56. People, oh wow, Paul did a 53. Yeah, I know that lap time was slow. I think I'm gonna have to look at my best lap time. Could have been a lot cleaner, a lot more tighter. You need to serve that black flag. There's 55. The flag. Over. Yeah. I know I could have actually went into the 54s because I do believe I because I do believe I went uh, went that fast in practice. Um, all time. Yeah, my best, my all-time best was a 54.9. I mean, I barely had just broken into the 54, so, uh To be fair, this is my first time with this track and com- Trap and- Track and combo. Doing this, and I only had about, you know, around 30 minutes of practice, so. Alright, good. Qualifying is up. Let's see where we're going to be starting. Uh, 29th. I'm alright with that. And yeah, we're pretty far down in the order. I mean, a lot of people actually with uh, with lower I rating has qualified in front of us. Wow, the the person who did a 53 is is number 30. That's actually one left to green. Impressive. Line up on the inside. 
The estimated strength of field is 1,752. Pit road is closed right now. It's competitive out there. How many tires do we have? Stay Seven? Sharp. All right, so there's around 40 laps of fuel in the car for a fuel tank. I say around 40 because I, I think, I can't remember, but it was like, I think last time I looked at it, it was, oh no, okay, it's around 60. So scratch that. Uh, there's It's going to be at least a two-stop race. If we go green for a good portion of it, who knows, it might end up being only a one-stop race if we have enough cautions. <laughs> but no, more than likely it is going to be a two-stop race. Which, I mean, seven is a lot of tires for us to have. You have but uh, at the same time, tires five. wear out Great. really quickly. And have a good run. How many people are behind us? Okay, not that many. Catch the 28 car. Catch the 16 car. Catch the 14 car. Catch the 1 car. Catch the 5 car. Catch the 7 car. Everyone got off the line sensibly there. Because there was gaps from people starting from the pit lane, which, I mean, a part of me was thinking about starting from the pit lane, but I don't know. I don't really like to do that. I mean, as search as, I mean, I used to do that, I'm not gonna lie, that's how I got, I think my first oval win at uh, Daytona was starting from the pits, um, but ever since iRacing, you know, declared a rule about starting from the pits, um, purposely, um, I've been kind of like wanting to follow that, so. But at the same time, many About people don't green, stay follow that. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's still in their sporting regulations in iRacing. So... Whoops. I didn't want to have a big gap there. Green, green, green! Looks like everyone got off the line sensibly. Oh my god, this car is tight. Inside, slow car ahead. Clear inside. How is that not a caution? Inside. Clear inside, inside. Clear inside, car inside. Clear. Okay, this car's so out of whack because I didn't car start inside. right. And the tires are cold. Stay high. Still there, hold your line. Clear inside. Clear. 
Inside. Clear inside. I honestly really thought there was going to be a yellow there. But apparently, uh, whoever wrecked didn't get slowed down enough. Or didn't stop on track or something. Whatever happened for them to not trigger the yellow. But I'm not too worried because I know there's going to be something up ahead that's... Or even behind us that was, that's going to cause a yellow. Yeah, yeah, see, once we actually started get, getting going, that estimated thing actually went back down to 30. So, yeah, we're going to actually have a multiple stop race if it keeps on going green like this. Because I was thinking, like, 60 laps? It doesn't sound right. Oh, so I'm having a feeling as these tires wear out, people are going to make mistakes, so... Yeah, see, turn one always kind of catches me off guard.
Alright, I should be getting his draft here soon. The yellow flag is out. Line up, single file. Closed, pit road is closed. Catch up, seven, car. There's Four, flying car, bumpers! Seven, I don't know what in the hell happened, but I'm glad we arrived at the scene a little bit in the ap in the aftermath. Because <laughs> there's still bumpers just... Or, or, yeah, front bumpers just flying around. Catch that, 27, car. Hitboxing. 10. 5. 3. 2. 1. Right here. Let's just see our state of the tires. Okay, so mm, we could have got the new tires go, for go, sure. Go. Line up, single file. Catch up, 19, car. Like, we could go ahead and come on in, I think, this lap. If we wanted to get some new tires, but... We might screw ourselves over, but I am gonna save a set, at least for... Because we didn't... Because um, we, we only went about a quarter tank if that worth of fuel or used a quarter tank worth of fuel so don't get me wrong we will be hurting if this goes a little bit longer of a run but I'm just wanting to try to save some tires one left to green you'll be lining up on the inside catch up 34 car 160 left. So does that mean in in the actual ra in the Indianapolis race um, that's coming up, like in in the actual like you know NASCAR series, is it actually going to be 240 laps? Because usually these races run half distance of the actual. Um, of the actual uh, real uh, real event. About to go green. Stay focused. And usually in the Indies like 200 laps because of the you know Indy 500 and stuff. So but I wonder if they only are doing that to make it not the Indy 500 but for NASCAR or something. I don't know. Green, green, green. No 
okay then? That was a little bit too close. I drifted over. That, that would have been totally my fault if we made contact, because I drifted over a little bit too early before we got cleared. Flag is out. Line up, single file. Pit road is closed right now. Catch that, 34. Car, catch that, 33. Car. Left that, 33. Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. Yep, did not want to have anything to do with that. Uh, let's Get see, ready. we're going wow, we're still 18th. We still gained some places on that pit stop, I think. Green, green, green. Inside. Still inside. Still there, inside. Clear. Car inside. Clear. Car inside. I am terrible at the restart. Clear. Either that or people behind me actually have press tires. That could also be the case. Still there. Still there at the bottom. Clear inside. You're up top, three wide. Right side, two wide. Clear, car inside. Keep high. Clear inside, car inside. Still there at the bottom. Clear inside. I'm just taking it easy as possible to make sure I don't wreck. Inside. Oh Clear my god, inside. that was close. Inside. Still there. Still there at the bottom. Clear. Car inside. Clear inside. I think what my problem is on the restarts is that the tires get cold. And I'm just not that confident on cold tires.
ships. No damage. Car looks clean. Okay, yeah, we're lucky to get away with that. I wonder if the person behind me also doesn't have fresh tires. Just take your fastest lap of the day. Disaster. Try to send it on around the outside. real hard for that. You're pulling away from the car behind. The gap is one second. To be honest, if we finished anywhere like 20th or a better, or 20th or you know better, I'm gonna be happy with that. Which I constantly am believing we can do that with our pace. We just need to have a good restart and stay in front of the and stay in front of people. Or the race just needs to stay green for long enough. damage to report. Your 
Engaging on the current front. The gap is 1.1 seconds. Whoa! That would have definitely hit up my rear tires. Yeah, I can already feel them. Overheated. It'd be cautious by with the person behind us because they already caught us after getting around that lapped car that we were also stuck behind. Almost lost it there again. They're probably gonna get me on the straight, so I'm not gonna fight it too much. I'm just gonna uh, stay on this outside line. Go inside. Stay high to the car on the low side. I mean, they are Clear faster inside. than us. I do think. Or at least they're more consistent. So let's have them go on ahead. I mean, our tires are pretty much going dead. They've ran their best life. Definitely, if there's another yellow, we're gonna... My god, that dirty air. If there's another yellow, we're definitely gonna uh, put on some new tires. Wow, it turned in way too early for that. You're losing on the car in front. The gap is 1.1 seconds. Caution, yellow flag. Line up, single file. Pit road is closed right now. Catch up, 27 car. Oh, 
And there we go, another caution, so... Let's go ahead and put uh, four new tires on and fill her up. We're almost about a half a tank, so we ran a pretty good run. The pit road is now open. I'm having a feeling everyone's about to go into the pits, though. Thirty-one. Car. Pit box in. Line up single file, pass that twenty seven car. See, 79 on the right, on the right front, 83 on the left front, so. One to go, next time by, line up on the inside. Could be Catch better. 29, car. Could be worse. So yeah, I was right originally, the, the, uh, the fuel, a full tank of fuel will last you around 30. So I'm guessing around 40 laps. I mean, I'm pretty sure that will change once we get going again, but for sure, I mean, definitely we're going to have to stop around two or three more times. I mean, depending on the cautions or whatnot, but definitely I would say at least one more, if not two more times, depending on how long the green flag About goes. To go green, stay focused. It all just kind of depends on when you come in to get fuel and when you come in to get tires. Both cars off, or time both. to do your job. Green flag, green flag. The car in speed, hey, just set the fastest lap. 53.888, outside. Outside. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Clear. Caution, yellow flag. They want you in single file. Closed, pit road is closed. Pass up, seven, car. Must have happened behind us. Pass up, seven, car. Get ready, going green. Alright. So we're in 14th, that's actually pretty high up there. Green flag, green Let's try flag. not to get swamped by people trying to make up positions. Inside. Stay high. Clear.
Maybe I don't have the guy. Still inside. Clear inside. Car 17. He's up the front. I mean, if we're able to finish within, like, say, the top 15 or even the top 20, I'm happy. Keep on missing my braking point right inside. there. Stay high to the car on the low side. Clear inside. Inside. Still inside. Still there. Clear inside. Still there. Still there at the bottom. Clear inside. I wanted to get up on or get up in his inside, but Way too early. Car outside. Clear outside. You're losing on the car in front. The gap is one point four seconds. We don't have wheel damage. Outside is clear. We can get that fixed during the next caution. Or at least hopefully most of it. That's probably is gonna cause some drag and possibly some right front extra wear. It doesn't feel like it's causing any extra wheel malarkey. So we got lucky with that. I honestly don't know what that was. I think that was just me. I think that was just me um, steering way too much. Yeah, I'm definitely losing time.
thankfully not too terribly much. It's not like I'm bleeding off time, so I can live with this. Stop doing that, or else we're gonna get wheel damage. We got damage on the front end. <laughs> You're losing on the car in front. The gap is one second. Broke way too late for that. is definitely getting a little bit more tight with that front end damage. The temperatures doesn't look like it's affected at all and I don't think it would be with front right damage. I think this I think it's going to be affected. It's not like we rear-ended someone. But it looks like around P16 or so, P8, yeah, around P16 to 19 is where we're running. I mean, I know we're losing the cars in the front, but that's, I feel like that's only because we have the damage. And we're about to lose this position because of the damage, so. Hopefully we can get most of it, if not all of it, fixed. Uh, I know exactly how I messed up and got damaged, and it was because of something similar like that. Definitely using the tires more. So next time whenever we come into the pits, I'm definitely gonna get some new tires. Oh my god. Gaining on the car in front. The gap is 1.5 seconds. Car inside. Clear. That was so... My car got so tight and then so loose.
I also was really lucky he didn't rear end me. why he came into the pits. More people are coming into the pits. I wonder if it's people that didn't pit under caution. I'm just taking it easy for now. I'm not exactly pushing too hard. wreck the flow of that corner.
The car behind is closing on you. The gap is 1.8 seconds. Car is starting to feel a lot more loose, a lot looser. Like it's really tight in the mid corner, but it's like really loose in the entry and exits. I was looking down at the time in that split second. Yeah, the two people behind me is definitely catching me. I mean, I'm also making mistakes and stuff all the while, so... I'm also just taking it extremely easy because I don't want to bend it in the wall.
I knew what would happen if I would have kept my throttle in there and would have drifted out. Outside. Keep low. Outside, clear. Car outside. Go low. Outside is clear. I really don't want to pit till it's till I absolutely have to. You're losing on the current. Just because of a uh, just because of yellows. Way too late for that. Saved it though.
Oh, that was so close. Alright, we're not gonna get this. Closing on you. The gap is one point six seconds. We're not gonna pit this lap, but we're gonna pit next lap. I forgot to downshift. <laughs> I don't really want to pit under green, but we're, but we're going to have to. We can stretch this one more lap, but... Not the best pit entry, but... Five. Three. Two. One. Right here. All the damage is repairable. Okay, I thought we was gonna have to... Uh, back up there for a second. All clear, punch it!
Yeah, I cooked those tires. The car in C12, just set the fastest lap, 53.777. Pulling away from the car behind, the gap is 3.1 seconds. Car in P9, just set the fastest way, 53.256. How is first place not pitted yet? He must be still massive of fuel the lead is pitting now. Okay, there, there they go.
I honestly really need a yellow. To fix this damage, because it really actually is affecting me. I was lost in there. what went on there.
Oh shit. We got damage on the front end. Okay. Avoided wheel damage, that's what my main concern was. The car behind is closing on you. The gap is one second. Now, now this is the part of the run where the car starts to feel all weird. Totally messed up my breaking point then. The car behind is closing on you. The gap is 3.7 seconds. Oops. We got damage on the front end. Yeah, man, I really need a caution. And all this damage. All this damage, I do believe it's like it's rubbing on the tire or something or making the tire just wear out faster. Also making the car feel a little bit weird in the middle of the run.
Damn it. <laughs> Really shut up about that. about to get lapped. Which I would really like to have a yellow come out like right now. Closing on you. The gap is 1.3 seconds. The leader is coming up on you. They're not at five.
leader is coming up on you. Do not have fight. Stay high. Clear. Inside. Still there at the bottom. Clear inside. There goes our lucky dog position. Car inside. Clear inside. I'm actually thinking about short pitting here soon.
car inside. Clear inside. Yeah, I, I'm gonna pit. I'm, I'm pitting. Pit box team, 10. Car outside. The leader is coming up on you. They're not our fight. Clear up top. I didn't even realize I, that I put myself up to fifth gear. Inside. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Clear, you're losing on the car in front. The gap is three seconds. Gotta be careful around these people around me. Because uh, we're not on the same lap and they 
Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Clear. Yeah, we definitely don't... We definitely have lost a lot of time to the people around us. Outside. Still there. Stay low. Outside, clear. See, we can make it definitely to the pit, pit window, sure, but we're going to have to really extend this, this run, the stint. Once the leader pits and everything, we'll be back on the lead lap. Although I don't feel like we're gonna be. I honestly don't know where we're at in the pit cycle because we've actually pitted like 10 laps early, about.
gaining on the current front. The gap is 2.7 seconds. Car inside, stay high. There's a car on the low side. Clear. Inside. Still there. Clear. Once we get into the pits. Oh no, we're two Let's laps down. Ah, oh, whatever. We got damage on the front end. We've got damage on the back end. I do believe it was a 33 that we got Deep tangled up open. with. I I shouldn't have dived it up in there like that. So, hold on, this is weird. If... Hmm. Like, I am honestly hoping for another yellow. Because I am... Hopefully I will get the wave around. But I'm probably still going to be a lap down. I'm pretty sure that's how it's going to work. I'm not 100% sure. Well, we're going to figure uh, find it out here soon. I want it to come in, but at the same time, I want my lap back. I want it back! Oh well, the, oh well, we only got a 2x from that, that's... One to go, next time by, line up on the inside. Pit road is closed, past the pace car. Catch up, 17 car. A lot of people actually are gonna get the wave around, so I am actually not quite sure if we are gonna get our lap back. <laughs> like, cause a lot of people behind us that are technically also a lap ahead of us, So yeah, I'm not sure how that actually is going to work. Yeah, I don't think we're actually going to get our lap back. Either way, it's kind of deserved because we we were at fault there. I'll totally put my hands up and... I'll totally put up my hands and say that was all on me because I dove it down in there and I my car just drifted up there. I mean, there... Whenever I say there's nothing I could do, you know, I could just, you know, not actually, you know, cause that wreck. Or I could have just backed out and not caused the wreck, but... 
um, I don't know, it just, I was, I didn't want to give up that position as well, so. About to go green, stay focused. Post car is off. Green flag, green flag. You're on the bottom, three wide. Car outside, two wide. Still there, hold your line. Still there. Outside is clear. Car outside. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Still there. Outside, clear. Car outside. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Clear high. Outside. Clear outside if you want it. I guess the big takeaway from that is that we didn't go two laps down. front end back now. I, I do remember that from checking after immediately after the wreck. I don't think everyone that's pitted well, I don't think that they're good on fuel. I think they're still going to have to pit one more time. Actually, no, they, they actually might be good. Stop hitting that wall!
I am gonna try to run down the fuel. All the way down. Just, just because I want to see if I can, if I can actually get a caution or not. Looks like we got to lap around 145 before we we're gonna have to pit.
They're probably someone that's behind us. Whoever's fitting in. Hopefully we actually gain a position, but I doubt it. Yeah, I'm gonna just continue to stretch this out as long as I can. Hoping for a caution.
there's two laps of fuel left. about one lap of fuel left. They are coming in to pit this time. We, we have to. <laughs> Oh yeah, look at that fuel pressure going Don't down. Don't forget to pit this lap for more fuel. Pit box in 10. That was a shaky exit on oh, oh no. Please don't please don't give me a speedy speedy penalty. Caution, yellow flag. Of course! They want you in single file. <laughs> of course that's how it was pitting! Where's the 13? Uh, if only we had enough fuel to go like one more lap. Alright, hopefully I didn't wait too long. One to go, next time by. Line up on the inside. Catch the 22 car. Get ready, going green.
Alright, so there. Okay, the pace car isn't off yet, but. There are, yeah. It's terrible, but they're definitely gonna go for the. Like, catch up the back. Green flag, green flag. <laughs> My hope is now is for them to wreck, to have to be in a big old wreck and have a lot of them to DNF for get you know big enough uh, meatball flags and whatnot to, for me to capitalize on positions. Caution, yellow flag. They want you in single file. Pit road is closed. Catch up one car. Wow, we've been going for almost three hours now. Shit. And to be fair, we've been running mostly green. This is just a long ass race. I mean, we've had a few cautions, but it's not like it's been a caution field race. Yeah, I have way too much fuel in here, but at the same time, I'm like two laps down, and I don't think the fuel calculator accounts for that. And also, I don't really mind because of the whole green-white checker deal so and I have enough fuel for Get ready. all Going three green. all three attempts so better to have, be overfueled for green white checker to chimps than be underfueled the car is off be ready green flag green flag Thank you for the 4X there. I was just talking about recently how we was doing good on incidents. I mean, if anything, just blame it on the 10 in front of me. Because they're the one that checked up. Car outside. Go low. Clear outside if you want it. a little bit too early for that, but we would rather break early than break too late and smash ourselves into the wall. Yeah, I got confused on the brake markers just then. Oh shit.
car inside. Still inside. That was your fastest lap of the session. Things are looking good. Keep high. Are they? <laughs> Don't tell me that and then when we finish the race, you give me some shit about let's schedule some testing or whatever. Caution, yellow flag. They want you in single file. Closed, pit road is closed. Catch up, 32, car. Catch up, 32, car. Catch up, 13, car. Catch up, 32, car. About to go green, stay focused. Post car is off, time to do your job. Green, green, green. Car outside. Clear outside. Yeah, Let's that was go. a bad getaway. Don't exactly blame outside. them for cutting. Clear up the top. Outside. For cutting in front of me like that. Outside, clear. Nothing I could have done for that. Got wheel damage. There's a green white ticket finish when the yellow clears. Your car has too much damage. We've got to fix it. You've got wheel damage. Holy shit! I went from f what the fuck? I went from four X to ten X because of that. What dumb motherfuckers? Please don't put me on the outside. One left to green. You'll oh, be lining God. up on the inside. Catch up, 29, car. I'm gonna cheese the game as much as I can. Because, I mean, I'm not... I don't think the... The meatball flag, like the count... The laps that it counts down is during the... Caution laps. I'm pretty sure. So... I'm going to pretty much pull over. At the start of the... At the start of everything. Or, you know, not exactly pull over, but... Uh, but I'm gonna try to get ready going green Post car is off Green flag green flag Car outside why the fuck did you do that?
losing on the car in front. The gap is 8.4 seconds. All right, I'm gonna pit this time. I'm gonna pit on the white flag, which I'm not quite sure how this is gonna turn out. That was very stupid though by whoever that was. I don't know why the fuck did, I was obviously slow on the bottom. Why, why the fuck would you come down like that? And try to, there was no fucking gap. There was no way you could fucking squeeze a gap from right there. The car in front is pitting. Actually, fine, if the car in front is pitting. You got about five laps of fuel left. Yeah. All right, there's the checkered flag. Bring it back to the pits, we're going. Okay, I didn't actually gain a position. Okay, <laughs> I was a little confused on that. Um, I'm not quite sure um, if we're going to lose the 16th place or not, just because of how many laps it was actually out. Pit box team, 10. But that was also another Five, unnecessary 4x because of three, that fucking dumbass. Two, one. Right here. Seriously, like, why the fuck would you... Why the fuck would you do that? It is a 19 steer here. I mean, yeah, I mean, look at that, if, I mean, I guess, I guess if I was to hold my line, I guess he would have been able to, but I mean, still, that's, that's very, uh, good on the 19, though, for trying to, for keeping it together. I mean, if, if they said that, then apparently 
I'm not the only one who 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 thought that. I'm I'm glad that the 19 uh, saw that as well. That I was that it wasn't like egregious or anything like that on my part. It was the 19 just kind of come running up on the inside like that. I mean, I seriously don't understand. Oop, I. <laughs> okay. <laughs> A command that I use for the AI series, uh, or not, well, <laughs> well, uh, yeah, whenever I run AI races, <laughs> but yeah, I, did, was the 19 and the 14, well, okay, well, at least the 19 was actually on the lead lap and didn't get too much affected by that, I mean, looks like they was, like, back in the, pack so they it looks like they didn't get too much uh they wouldn't really gain too much because of all the other cars but uh yeah i do kind of actually want to see what happened oh When was it? I <laughs> I just saw it. Yeah, there wasn't really I could anything I could have done. Um, uh, I don't know if Eleven was holding his brakes and then let go or what, but I was already kind of committed to this line to the inside line. Uh, whatever. Even if I would have gotten through, there was there would have been a um, there would have been a small chance for me to not really gain that much uh we still finished 16th it look, looked like uh anyways let's let's see what our the result is for for this race probably lost more uh well more safety rating for sure um <laughs> yeah we was doing good on safety rating up until that very the very end of that race fucking hell uh but I mean, at least we got uh, a little bit of I rating. I mean, it we would have done better if um, if we uh, would have finished a little bit up more f up ahead. But uh, at least we didn't uh, finish further down. Huh. Looks like we just hit was finished like ahead of the cutoff point for I rating loss. Oh my god. Oh my god, I, I feel bad for this person. Oh no. Uh, anyways, yeah, that's that was kind of tough. That was kind of a tough race. It was a long one, like three hours altogether in this recording. Uh, probably will be chopped a little bit down because of um, me ch uh, chopping up the cautions and everything like that. But yeah. Yeah, that was, uh, uh, the end of the race didn't go as, as well as I would have hoped, but, uh, I mean, I guess we still finished, but, yeah, anyways, uh, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, if you want to see more of this content, please hit that subscribe button, and yeah, hope to see you in the next video, bye.